New tonight, a local school district has a new plan to protect students, weapon detectors, but some parents aren't convinced the technology goes far enough. And this new system comes with a $10 million price tag. News Force Walter Morris is at Freedom High School tonight in Woodbridge with the demonstration. We've had two guns in our schools already, and one gun is too many. Prince William County Public Schools is considering some serious security upgrades. Pretty soon, all middle and high school students may enter school through these high-tech scanners designed to detect weapons. We're implementing a lot of different safety and security measures to keep everybody safe. Say hello to the Evolve Express. You may have seen these types of scanners at museums, amusement parks, and major sporting events. And in the fall, the district is looking to bring them to all 34 middle and high schools in Prince William County in a phased rollout. Parents and students want to know when they come to school they're safe. Vernon Bach, the district's chief operating officer, says these are just one way they're beefing up security. He broke down the other upgrades during this meeting Monday evening at Freedom High School. The district is also investing in better surveillance technology, uniform security, school resource officers, and training. Dozens of parents sitting through the demo and some expressing concerns the district is missing the mark since the scanners have no way to detect dangerous drugs like fentanyl. I feel like resources need to be everywhere. Meanwhile, parents like Dawn Whitaker say she's pleased with what she saw. She has two seventh graders at home and she's looking forward to breathing a little easier when she sends them to school next year. In a way, it's hard to accept that we need these things, um, but we do need them. And I think that anytime we take steps that will deter things from happening, it's definitely a step in the right direction. And parents in the school district have another opportunity this week to ask questions. There's another meeting like this set for 7 p.m. Tuesday at Woodbridge High School. In Prince William County, Walter Morris, News 4.